wait, is there another? Oh my gosh! Welcome to Casual Nerd Reactions. My name is Chris, and I'm very excited to get into Predator 2 right now. Uh, I saw the first one only last week, and it was an 80s action adventure, and I thought it would be a little more scary than it was going in, so I'm curious to see what the tone of this one is, if it adds in a little more horror, or if it continues that same kind of mode. Uh, I am down for some more adventure, some more action, some more fun. Uh, or I'm also down to be terrified out of my mind. I'm good either way. I know Danny Glover takes over the lead role in this film and I'm excited to, to see how that uh, unfolds in what I believe is the streets of LA. We'll find out. This is really exciting. I did do a little bit of research to try to find out why did Arnold Schwarzenegger not uh, reprise his role? Come on, he was the victor of the last film. How come he didn't come back? And basically what I found was a combination of either money or he did not like the role that he was going to play should he return. And I believe they turned uh, his role into what is Gary Busey's character in this film. I don't know how much they tweaked or changed it uh, once Arnold declined to return. Either way, I'm excited to get into this film. Please hit the like button and subscribe for more content like this. Coming up on the channel, we have Schindler's List. You can also check me out on Patreon where you can find full length reactions to upcoming films, as well as this one and any movie on my channel. All right, thanks for being here. Let's get into the movie. Let's experience Predator 2 for the very first time. Oh, sounds. We're not wasting any time. We're in a war zone, Dave. Two motorcycle officers horribly wounded in a deadly crossfire. Oh boy, that gun seems serious. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, I would 100% believe they just blew up that car. Like, that is a real fire. Oh, practical effects for the win. All these different reporters. As Colombian and Jamaican drug fiends once again transform the streets of LA into a slaughterhouse. <laughs> oh, man. All right, who we got just driving and crashing through things? Is that, uh, is that Danny Glover? Yes! So when I think of like, you know, tough guys, like compared to the first movie, right? You had everyone was like buff and full of testosterone. I don't think of Danny Glover in that same category. So I'm real curious to see, you know, what is it that makes him a worthy opponent for the Predator? Oh, I'm so glad the music didn't like completely transform from the first one. I mean, the music was so great in the last one and it's it's carried over to this. Come on, guy. Get there, get there, get there. Oh, this is insane. Ooh, that noise. Oh. All right, so he's got like ingenuity on his side, right? So that it must be what is attracting the predator. Uh, he did it. He got on the other side of him, caught them off guard enough that they weren't able to aim. Very effective. Good job, man. He's got orders from Chief Heineman. He says secure perimeter, surround building, and wait. Wait? For what? I don't know. <laughs> oh, wow. What just happened? Let's go! Is the predator working on the side of the cops? Heineman's on his way here. Heineman, you kiss my sweet. Oh, jeez. <laughs> oh, man, that guy's crazy. Oh, I thought he was going to run through the window. <laughs> Yo, he is straight up panicking. Now lay your guns down. It's over. I said put it down. Oh, look what we see. Oh, dang. <laughs> oh, my gosh. What an epic fall. That looks amazing. Like, he really fell, right? Oh my gosh. Is he seeing? Doesn't know what he's seeing. And he's just gone. <laughs> Gotta get down from here. I was gonna say, yeah. Oh, yeah. We gotta see what the Predator did in the... Oh, boy. Yeah, that's a... <clears throat> They've been cut to pieces. Must be the Jamaicans. I like that she just like thinks the Jamaicans did it. Like, seriously? You think other humans did this? I obviously there are humans capable of great depravity and great destruction. 
But this is extreme to the maximum a level. Oh, something that we're uh, must have been killed out here. Somewhat familiar with someone. You couldn't carry him up there, Lieutenant. I'm glad someone's like this. Isn't quite normal. Oh, ah, oh, they didn't see that. That guy's alive. Oh, he's not alive. Okay, <laughs> they tricked me. Now you were told that this was a federal matter. Yet you disobeyed a direct order to stay out of the building. You're a soldier and you take orders. Now don't push it. I don't roll up for anybody, especially the feds. Insubordination. Disregard for direct orders from a supervising officer. Now get back to your cage at Alvarado. Wow. Oh no! I don't need this, Mike. It's not worth it. Yeah, he was going for it. I'm glad he has someone to kind of rein him in a little bit. He was about to get fired, for sure. Is D and I? And let it fly. <laughs> that guy, shut up. I want to hear what they're talking about. Lieutenant Harrigan. Detective hey, 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 Rampart. Hey, hey, kid. Hey, kid. Just have a seat. I'll be right with you. Special Agent Peter Keyes, DEA. Heard a lot about you. I'm sorry for this jurisdictional intrusion. Good start. I don't mean to be stepping on your toes. But you are, though. Cooperation is my middle name. Look at him playing the game, getting political. I'll see you around. He's grown so much over the course of this film, you know? I mean, from almost bashing in his superior's head. Let's see if it lasts. I love that he keeps ignoring that guy. He annoyed me right away. I'd ignore him too. Whew. Maybe King Willie brought in some outside talent. Whoever did this took out four men armed with machine guns by hand <laughs> and then got by us. Maybe we should give him a job. See, that would be kind of fun. If there was like a cartoon Predator 2 spinoff, the Predator would work for the police. I would have watched that See as a that kid. <laughs> That's for his replacement. This is what I call the speech, kid. It's the only one I got. I only give it once, so pay attention. Metro Command is a war zone. Lieutenant, I paid my dues. There's no room for showboats anyone looking to prove himself. It's a good now, speech. I won't stand for it. Now, don't Specifically wrong, for him. But the team comes first. You live by that and you'll be okay. Welcome to the war. <laughs> I can pay you. Can you? Two million dollars back. <laughs> In cash. He's Take the money. money. No, it's not about He's money, double. obviously. Oh, wow. Ooh. What are they trying to accomplish? I tell you what I believe. <laughs> oh, wow. He wasn't kidding. Oh my gosh. Oh, yes. Dude, I gotta be honest. I love that the Predator is hunting down bad guys. That's legit. <laughs> Good move. He got respect in my book for that. So how bad is it? What are they walking into? <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah. Yeah. This is more what I would have expected to see. Terrible. Oh, man. If the Colombians did all this, then why'd they leave their boss Ramon over there hanging tan and his girlfriend naked on the floor? It wasn't the Colombians. Our friend from the armory. We got a new play in town. I like that they're on the right track, but also are completely ill-prepared. Looks like a spear tip or something. This is a restricted area. I want it cleared immediately. You got a big nose, and you're sticking it too far in my business. The next time you cross me, you're gonna turn up missing. Dang, that's a real threat. These guys show up to DEA. Still Jesus party. You stick around, stay out of sight. I'll meet you at one o'clock. We'll take a good look at that room. Start a tail on keys. Everything he does, every way it goes, might just get lucky. Ten it. For luck. Is my specialty. This guy to me has all the trademarks of someone who's like just distinctly unlikable, but probably is incredibly important to this story. Or will get killed early on. One of the two. Uh oh. I'm worried he's gonna die before he meets Danny Glover's character. Uh. 
like I want him to get the evidence, right? But I also am not confident he'll survive this. Well, does it tell you any? No way. Oh my gosh, what? Oh! This is a great example of sometimes not showing is very effective. Oh, oh man, because you know it was bad. You're too close to the stay out of it. We'll find Danny's killer. Captain, Danny and I came up together. Whoever killed him is gonna pay. I'm gonna finish it. I mean, the Predator lost the first one. You think the Predator will lose this one too? We'll find out. Ooh, yeah, get him. Now it's personal. And he's a dead man. The concept of what you're dealing with is way over your head. I'm warning you. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. I'll take care of him. Let him go. Oh boy. We're too close. Was that guy just ready to kill him? That's what it felt like. This ain't your personal little war, you know? I love Danny too. He told me, Lieutenant, the only way you survive down here is because you're a team. All right, we'll do it together. Yes. They've been setting up these weird radar sensors all over downtown. I mean, I use my whole repertoire just to keep up with them. Those guys, Keys, they know what they're looking for. Leona, I want to meet with King Willie. Willie and I seem to have the same problem. All right, why is King Willie meeting him in such a shady fashion? Is that a cobra? I want some information. About the one that's doing all the killing, I uh, He killed your people. Now mine. I don't know who he is, but I know where he is. Okay, that's great information to share. There's no stopping what can't be stopped. No killing what can't be killed. Hey, make sense, man. Interesting. <laughs> the sound effects when he turned his head. <laughs> I can feel him all around. You can't see the eyes of the demon. Tell him come calling. Time to go. Well, this feels like it was a pretty much a waste of time, in my opinion. Uh, I don't think he really gained anything from visiting King Willie. Prepare yourself. Although that is good advice, he should prepare himself. Oh, what's that? Is King Willie about to be be dead? Is he in trouble? Oh no! Are you not gonna take your own advice? Prepare yourself! Run from this demon! Or just stand there! I mean, yeah, okay, go for it! That scream! Oh no! That was a cool transition to him just being beheaded. Oh my gosh! Ah. He got himself a real prize this time. Look at that skull. He's taking care to get all the humanity off of it. Fragment of wood from the penthouse. It contained traces of cattle blood and heavy traces of steroids. Whoever killed Detective Archuleta had recently been in a slaughterhouse. Take the metro well, something. Line. I'll pick you up at the burning station in an hour. Ooh, wow. Well. Now that's interesting. It's kind of like a trophy room. And we know that the Predator collects trophies. My uh, partner here needs an operation, but uh, we're a little short of cash, if you know what I mean. No need for that. Yeah. Oh! Wow, that was a very foolish thing to do. Lucky for him. You don't need any rush hour Rambos there. Obviously, I haven't seen Rambo, but I still have respect for the phrase, we don't need any rush hour Rambos here. That was a great line. Oh, dang. Holy crap. I'm not a fan of the strobe lights. I just can't see what's happening. I can't follow the action. Yeah. So he's gonna get killed now. Maybe he'll get some shots in and make the Predator bleed. We haven't seen any uh, shiny green blood yet. Right. What is that? Is that an explosive? Yeah. What was it? 
It was it just a golf ball? <laughs> well, I mean, I didn't have a lot of hope that he would last long against the Predator anyway. Still, I didn't want him to die. Oh no, don't go back there, lady. I don't want you to die too. I mean, you're more of a threat than that other guy was, so I feel like the Predator would enjoy hunting you more than him. I guess you shouldn't leave your partner behind, but he's dead now. Of course, she doesn't know that. Oh, gosh. Okay, it, it, it was just a golf ball, so... Okay. No, 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 come on. No, 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 no! You don't... No! Oh, wait, what is that? Is she pregnant? Perhaps he wouldn't kill a pregnant lady. Honor? Oh. Leona. Oh, oh, please. Leona. Oh. I'm picking up fetal heart zones. This woman is pregnant. Let's move. Do they typically just immediately check for fetal heart zones on every <laughs> single female they, they pick up in the ambulance? Is that standard procedure or was that just for our benefit to uh, eradicate all doubt? Either way, how lucky is she that she was pregnant? So is she going to be out of the movie now? Or is she going to come back towards the end and help him fight? I don't remember his character's name, but I have the urge to say, come on, Danny boy, because, you know, Danny Glover. But obviously Danny boy was a previous character in this film, and that would be confusing for us all. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, that's a great sound. <laughs> Why would you run after it shouting? I mean, it's a good thing the Predator was in I'm getting out of here mode, because I don't know why he didn't just turn around and kill you. You lucky dog. But what just, whoa, <laughs> the Predator's like Spider-Man. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, that felt good. Oh, this is cool. Dude, I love how like on the, the trail he is of this thing. I think it's still too early in the movie to like actually catch the predator, but this is awesome. I guess he's just looking for a private place to finish preparing his latest trophy. Oh no, whoa. Who are these guys? Why are they doing the kidnapping my guy here? Hey. Ten years ago, one of his kind stalked and eliminated an elite special forces crew in Central America. When trapped, the creature activated a self-destruct device that destroyed enough rainforest to cover 300 city blocks. Wow, that's a lot. He comes here every two days to feed. Hmm. Seems he has a taste for beef. I didn't think he was vegetarian. I didn't think he was vegetarian either. He hunts by seeing our heat. Block the hmm. heat and he's blind. These suits insulate all body heat, making the team invisible to the creature. We flooded right. the packing house with radioactive dust. The dust adheres to his body, making him visible. Honestly, this sounds like a pretty good plan. It's not gonna go according to, I assume. I can't wait to see how it all goes to hell. <laughs> okay. Oh, he knows. Or she. Setting lasers to stun. Oh, he can change the way he sees. Oh, that's cool. Okay, okay, so it can see something. Oh no. You see some Garber, your boys have been made. Get them out, Garber. They're walking to your trap. Get them out. Get them out. That key <laughs> is right behind your third floor structure. I love that he's taking matters into his own hands. Stop him. Oh. How come he's the only one who seems to care? Why don't the people in the van care about the people outside of the van? There! Oh, dang. You're all screwed. You're all, all dead. Whoa, wait, hang on. Busey's still alive. Come on. Oh. Didn't occur to me that he's not wearing a suit, so his heat signature. Oh no! Woo! 
cloaking's on the fritz. Ooh. Kind of an interesting obstacle, of course. I like the swinging uh, animals are obstructing the vision. If only you get out that door fast enough. Ooh, okay. Oh, we got blood. We got blood. Well, obviously his weapon is far more effective than the guy on the train who got slaughtered. Yes, my guy. Can you like quickly get his mask off and get a headshot before he can self-destruct? Okay, this is good, good strategy. Also the ter most terrifying thing you could do. Okay, shoot it in the head before it wakes up and destroys you. Uh, See, it's not dead, it's moving. A little bit anyway, more of it. <laughs> See, that was just as bad as a Bond villain who takes the time to monologue before executing the good guy. Why did you do your one-liner monologue? You should have just shot him. Oh, come on, y'all. Yes, I thought Busey was dead. Back again. Get out of here, Eric. Oh, Two-Face. It's between me and him. If Two Face was a Ghostbuster. Uh, whoa, what is that? It's cool. Oh, nice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Not nice. Oh, yeah. I'm glad that missed. It would have for sure killed him dead. Ooh, great idea, yes! Use his own weapon against him, come on, yes! That did not go how I thought it would go. Oh, jeez. Show move. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes, come on, yes. Just be careful, don't grab it too close on the edge. Is he activating the self-destruct? Crap. <laughs> His eyes, yes! Very cool, very good. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. And now the predator is missing an arm and in some stranger's bathroom. Maybe I get lucky and fall. <laughs> oh jeez. What is this? You. I mean. Okay. Uh, <laughs> yeah, whoever's house this is. Her wake up. Aww. There's somebody in the bathroom. Ah, uh, yes. I would like to see her take out the predator with a broom. That would be awesome. Meanwhile, Herb's just sleeping away. Missed the whole thing. <laughs> I don't think he gives a <laughs> <laughs> That might be the best line of the movie. Wow. Okay. Uh, what's down there? Why, why does this predator have like a home down here? I don't love that. Like, I mean, now, now it's like you're in his territory. He's probably regrouping, getting all kind of weapons in place, probably putting on a spare arm. Oh, is that all his trophies? Yeah. Is that an alien head? <laughs> yeah, that is definitely uh, alien or a xenomorph. Shoot. Oh, no. See, that worked out. I mean, he just seems like an apex predator at this point. Yes! All oh, right in the, mm. Yeah, get it in, get it in. <laughs> a little bit strange that the predator just freaked out and left his arms over here. He definitely could have reached Danny Glover's neck 
with the weapon he had in his hand there, but you know, whatever. The point is, it's over. I think. And there's no self-destruction, no atomic explosion here in downtown LA. Although what's beneath the freaking fog? Okay, don't make the mistake of assuming he's dead. Just get in there. Attack. Oh, wait, is there another? Oh my gosh, there's a whole group of them. Holy freaking crap. Ah, it's over. It's over. Just go home. Holy gosh. Ew. Is he smiling, kind of? Yeah, just just drop it. Okay. Surrender. Who's next? <laughs> that attitude's not gonna get you very far. Now here's the question: Will these group of people kill uh, in revenge for their fallen brother here? Or are they just gonna respect and honor the fact that he won the battle and leave? Oh. Oh no! Don't take it! 1715. So he just happened to have that artifact, or have they been on our planet since 1715? Very, very strange. Is he trapped on side of an alien spaceship right now? Yep, okay, yes, that. But he's not trapped! Oh man! What? <laughs> we lived. Here's my question. Uh, who's gonna believe him when he tells this story? What happened in there? So close. <laughs> oh, my mind is reeling. You'll get another chance. You think? That line alone feels like they set up a third film that perhaps never came into fruition. I don't know. I mean, obviously, there's more movies, but I don't think they're like a direct follow-up to this necessarily. So, did the Predators leave the planet, or did they go somewhere else on the planet? These are questions that we are not going to get answers to today. Oh, wow. Well, I just finished watching Predator 2 for the first time. Holy cow, that last act was incredible. I I know I saw some people who said that Predator 2, they prefer more than the original, and I fall into that category. For me, they dropped the um, super macho testosterone uh, kind of fueled action, and it was more of a straightforward action flick. And that last 45 minutes was some of the most uh, engaging as he's like, hunting this predator from building to building. Um, that was absolutely <laughs> incredible. I had a great time watching this. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Those extra predators at the end. We got like four or five bonus predators at the end. And I love that they, they let them go. They didn't kill them. They didn't take like a posture of revenge. They just kind of like, that level of respect, um, hey, you killed the guy who, who was supposed to, who was hunting you, you won, you earned our respect, here's a gun from 1715, what was that about? Do we ever find that out uh, in this? Uh, one of the things that I find really interesting is a lot of people like in the comments seem to know a whole lot about the lore of the Predator, and from these first two films, they don't really give us a lot of the lore, they don't give us a lot of the backstory. I know they give us some uh, in future installments, but I feel like maybe maybe a lot of what other people know are from the comics or from various other sources. So like, let me know, where do you get your source of information about alien culture and all that stuff, or predator culture, <laughs> uh, as the case might be uh, in this one? Wow. Please let me know in the comments, what are your thoughts on Predator 2? Uh, what is your favorite movie in all of the Predator franchise? I just found out that there's a new Predator film coming out called Prey here uh, pretty soon. What are your thoughts on that? What is that even about? And hey, I wanna thank you for watching. Please hit the like button, subscribe. Check me out on Patreon if you'd like to support the channel. And oh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.